Hello Superset Maniacs and welcome back to my channel. Bodybuilding needs to be entertaining as well, at least this is what I'm trying to do on this channel. You've got all sorts of bodybuilding channels out there, focusing on reporting the news, focusing on the history of bodybuilding, also focusing on comparisons and analysis. And even though I also try to do all that, probably not as good as some of these other channels, what I also try to bring to the bodybuilding community is the entertaining side. So today we're going to have Ronnie Coleman, the best bodybuilder of all time, on the 2021 Mr. Olympia stage. Mainly for entertaining purposes. We all know what's gonna happen, we all know Ronnie is gonna beat everyone, especially because I have chosen his best shape of all time, his 1999 Mr. Olympia physique. This version is recognized by most fans as his best shape ever. Before we begin, if you really enjoy these kind of videos, leave a like, it helps the channel more than you can think. Thank you. As we already can observe in the front double biceps pose, Ronnie Coleman was bigger than Hardy and Brandon and also more conditioned, at least more than Brandon. Big Ronnie in 2021 is bigger than 99 Ronnie, but Ronnie is much sharper. His guns are superior, his overall shape and muscle quality are superior as well. In 99, Ronnie's midsection was on point, so nothing you can take away from him here. At least in this first pose so far, Ronnie Coleman is just on another level of roll. The front lat spread, and I expected Big Rami to look better in comparison to Ronnie in this pose, I have to admit. But as they look here, I think Ronnie might have the edge again. Ronnie definitely has the edge over both Rami and Brandon, your 2021 top 2 finisher, as far as the conditioning is concerned. And also with the lats, as his lats are more visible out of all four of them. Even Ronnie's midsection looks better than Brandon's in this shot. For what, for what it's worth, Ronnie is battling Hardy for first place in this pose and I believe he is winning this battle. It's too bad we don't have a side chest for the 2021 lineup in this specific photo album I decided to edit because I believe Rami, Hardy and Brandon would have looked great against Rami, who has one of the best side chests ever. In spite of uh, this photo of his where he does not open enough to really showcase his full potential. So trying to not leave this pose in the air for a conclusion, I really believe that a drier big Rami could get. Ronnie in trouble in this pose, but as they look here, any advantage Big Rami would have over Ronnie is lost because of the conditioning difference. Hadi may actually be too small for Big Ron and Brandon too soft, just like in Rami's case. So this is yet again Ronnie Coleman for me. From the back, things become even worse for our 2021 Olympia Top 3, but let's be honest, Ronnie Coleman is just on another level when it comes to the back. I gotta give credit to Hardy and Brandon though, they look quite good here from the back and the big Rami as well, he overpowers Ronnie with mass. But this is a no brainer, Ronnie simply dominates in this pose, from the conditioning to shape, details, thickness, arms, back, lower body, everything. In the other back pose, the back lat spread, we have the same story, Ronnie dominates. Once again I have to give credit to Big Rami for making Ronnie Coleman look small, but size is not everything. I also want to mention that Hardy's level of dryness rivals or even exceeds that of Ronnie Coleman, but Ronnie has the advantage of having that paper thin skin. Overall Ronnie Coleman wins another pose in this comparison. For those of you who were quote unquote fearing that uh, Ronnie is gonna get all the poses in this comparison, we got to that point where Ronnie usually drops the ball, the side triceps pose. I think it's pretty safe to say that Ronnie gets last place in this one, not only that his triceps uh, is the weakest, but also his execution looks odd, his midsection sticks out and he doesn't flex the lower body enough. It's true he still has the conditioning over Ronnie and Brandon, but I wouldn't put Ronnie above any of them in this pose as they look here, would you? The abs and thighs is the other pose where Ronnie stands back, his abs are unesthetic, spilling out like that and also having that gap in the middle. 
His execution is also uninspired if you ask me, but at least against Brandon here, I think he's got the advantage. Mostly because of the lower body, but also because of Brandon's lack of details and separation through the abs. However, both Big Rami and Hari Chupan beat Ron in this pose, no doubt about that. In the most muscular, let's use this hands clasped variation for Ronnie against Big Rami, where I believe he's got the upper hand. Rami has the mass and the midsection, but Ronnie wins the conditioning, the details, and overall muscle quality and separation. For a more accurate look, versus Hardy and Brandon, we're gonna have Ronnie hit the crab variation as well. Upper body per upper body, Brandon looks more than impressive against Ronnie here. I have to give him credit for that. But Ronnie once again doesn't leave room for interpretation with conditioning and lower body superiority. Hari is last in this pose in my opinion. Besides overall size, his arms and shoulders let him down against these guys here. In conclusion, as I'm sure all of you have expected, Ronnie dominates the 2021 Olympia top 3. It wasn't even close to be honest. I'm not gonna bash today's generation, that's not the case as I believe prime Ronnie Coleman would do the exact same thing to probably any other lineup in bodybuilding history. But I hope you guys enjoyed the show. Like I said in the beginning, this was purely for entertaining. Leave a like to this video if you appreciate the work and want to support the channel. Leave your thoughts in the comment section below. Subscribe to the channel and as always, thank you guys and see you next time.